we're here at Locust Projects, and I created this installation here at Locust, where the series of um, cuts and cutouts and and coring of the floor, uh, it's a series of um, site-specific intervention where I take the built environment and really explore these ambiguous spaces above and below the ground. We pull slabs that are about 700 pounds up in the air, so you're now standing above and below the floor. Um, the work really cuts into and conflates, you know, these um, these built environment, these, these moments of tension. Um, worked on manipulating the metal to get it really organic and um, and playful. For me, I conceptualize the work. It first comes from me just you know conceiving the idea and then trying to articulate that on paper. And once I get it on paper, I then try to fabricate it and produce it. And it does take a uh, there's several steps and process coming to the space, looking at the space, really getting a feel for the overall space, how to activate it as a with the work, but also as a viewer, how the viewer is going to activate it. So I made pretty much everything you see, I made it all out of cardboard maquettes, made it all life size to scale, and then started cutting where, the, where they're gonna get placed. Because once you, you know, once you cut the concrete, it's, it's, it's like one shot. It's, even though it looks very spontaneous, spontaneous and organic, it takes a lot to make it look that effortless and, and, you know, and lightweight. play with the built environment but also man-made versus versus nature made um, we, we really dug into the floor five to fit five to six feet depths and got into the oolite and, and limestone which is a very cyclical process of concrete and limestone becoming you know what what to use what the you know the Romans built you know first engineered concrete and so to have like those histories and those moments that you see in the floor and above you they're very minimalist, abstract, and also um, found abstract paintings above us. There's quite a few murals back. Well, the work the work does follow my thread, my practice of working with concrete, metal, and, and you know, steel and um, and dirt. Um, Inter engaging in the space, intervening, and um, um, this took, you know, it's been like nine months of conversations, discussions, sketches um, with, with my team, with my partner, um, with myself, and, and then with the director as well. You know, it's really tough to get a space to convince you to drill into their floor, but to cut out the floor and then to dig below it, you know, I'm really, you know, glad to have the opportunity at Locust allowed me to like just go below the, the surface and not hit water. We all cross our fingers. Because um, I hear here in Florida, you could, you could dig somewhere three feet deep and you'll hit the wa hit water and sink the space. So we made sure we, we avoided those things.